And we back, and we back, and we back. I am in New York City, guys. And I got a four floor walk up. I just got out of my Uber. Um, I'm staying at my boy Jackson's place. You can never find an apartment without it. This is the second time I've been. I mean, I've known Jackson for years. He's in the same apartment for a pretty long time. Um, no, I'm sorry. This is now his third apartment that I've known him in. And it's a walk up again. Man's cannot find an elevator. But either way, I'm happy to be back in New York. I'm only here for two days. Oh, I took a red eye last night. So, slept on the plane. And just now getting here into the city. Oh. Oh, baby. There he is. Right there you go, buddy. I like it. Oh, Jack, it's crazy. Good to see you. Good to see you. All right. Okay, how are you? I'm going to take the shoes off. What's up, buddy? Good, how are you? That's my first time at your new spot. Are you serious? Yeah. What? That's insane. Take a look around. I've only seen it. Crazy. I only seen it on FaceTime like when we first. Oh, yeah. When you first got it. Well, that's you right now. I had a long weekend. But... I was just telling the vlog, you can't seem to get an apartment with an elevator. Oh, yeah. No, <laughs> but the crib is sick. This is fire. The stairs are where it's at. I know, the stairs are lit. Oh, yeah. No regrets. <laughs> Wait, what? Give us a sex cleanup. <laughs> yeah, this is fire. How was your flight? It was good. I mean, my flight was at 11.50 last night, so. Oh, shit. You had a red eye? Yeah. That's insane. Just took the red eye. Nice and quick. Oh, bro. I need to figure out how far I gotta go. I gotta go straight to set. Where's, where's set? In Brooklyn. Oh, shit. Where? Um, this spot called Brooklyn Blend. It's like a cafe. I gotta, I gotta do this thing for high beast. I'm just like wearing some shoes. Oh, that's cool. High beast. Yes, sir. Wait, this spot is pretty. Like your crib is pretty prime. Far? No, it's prime. Like you got a great spot. Oh, location wise. Like I'm looking like, at you on the map right now. You're like perfect. We're in the mix, bro. Bridge, yeah. This Brooklyn is. Right there. This is fire. Well, you got three pairs of JMMs. Oh, well, we, have, we have five in this house alone. Like collected, both yeah, of you. Yeah. Wait, Wait, you have more. You have I five. Have, I have five. You said we have. Five. He has five. <laughs> I have. Th I have three. Bro, what? Well, bro, they just had an employee sale. I know, and I, bro, I just got these from you guys. Yeah. So I didn't like. I didn't want anything. I got three pairs. I got. I got. I got so I didn't want anything, but the next one I'm gonna get something for sure. I already got a pair I want. Yeah, that was sick. Fire. These new hats on this yeah, area? Yeah, new ones. Can I show, the, can I show that, the vlog? That navy one is crazy. The navy is sick. Can I show the vlog? Yeah, that one's gonna go crazy. Oh. If you guys know me at Rodeo, which I'm sure you do, um, Jackson is the owner. Him and Noah work together on it. And uh we got some new some new hats coming. Maybe one of those nuts. It's chain stitch? Chain stitch. Bro, this is fire. I'll say bro, I need every color now. Yeah, absolutely. This is sick. Like brown brown and green would be crazy. What does this even mean? Hedonism. For super sweatshirt. Oh. That's kind of sexy. That one's real demonic though. It's kind of sexy. It, the days on the way, like the horses. Wait, all these are new? All of them are new. Oh, wow. Boy, you're going crazy. Bro, congrats on Travis. Bro, yeah. Travis 
Kelsey in the hat is nuts. That was crazy. He he came to the store. Oh really? Yeah. Kelsey was asking me. She's like, how did she's like, how did all these people keep getting all these hats? Bro, patron, bro. Dang. God all right. patron. Paul stays in Paris. And then bro, Rio. he he pulled up and like I hadn't seen him in a minute. Um, right, cause you like you sold him before. I've met him a few times. I met him okay. at catch. Okay. Like I've been around him. Yeah. But like I hadn't seen him because obviously he's been like you know super starred up now. And so he comes in, he's like mad chill, and uh, he only bought one hat, and that was the hat. He bought one hat. He and bought the, one and, hat, and the, the MR hat was it. And that was it. Damn. And then I you know you never know when they're gonna like wear it or whatever, bro. Two days after. Hat at Yankees game, nonetheless. He had a B1 jacket on too. Yeah, the B1 jacket, yeah, yeah. exactly. And then John, John texted me, I was like, yeah, you got the B1 on too. We're not rocking for B1. Hey, wait, you guys sell B1 at Patreon? Uh, we, we sell the Patreon. Oh, wow. We still have some like that. Uh, uh, because, um, did, uh, what was I about to say? Did, uh, did Jeremiah put that on? Put that together? Yeah, we, we've had it, we've had it for a bit, because they were with summer games, but it's like a small buy. Yeah. It's good. I mean, we have some good pieces. That piece he got was good. You guys are in the same showroom, no? Or yes. you were, or you still are? Uh, kind of up in the air right now. Got you. Because they're like been moving too many things around, and like, I'm like, I don't know. I kind of want to do my own thing. Really? Are you doing Paris in January? Yeah, I'm working on a new collection now. Fire. It's going to be a little tighter, but we're doing like leather, like full leather set, denim set, corduroy set, we're doing the flannel. No way. Um, so I'm, I'm trying to, um, I look you want to do like a showroom for pasture. Yeah, you should. Like I mean, a point. If you want. I, mean, like, I, was, I was supposed to talk to Joey soon. Because like, I, I just like want to do like, I don't want to do with all the brands and like. Yeah, I get it. They didn't really do much for me, honestly. Like, I already had a lot of the accounts. Yeah, I remember you said that. And I was kind of like, all right, well. And, they, and then they like disappeared when I needed them most. I love Victor though. I, well, he's not even working with them anymore. Oh, well then, yeah. Screw it. Yeah, like, like they hired a bunch of new people. Like, a lot of people left. I was like, alright. I don't know. I don't think I'm chopping them. Bro, the chrome boots. Oh, the West Coast. Oh, those are bro. some stuff. Chrome West Coast? What are we talking about? Yeah, those are, those are, no, those are me. Jesus. No, we don't wear the same size shoe, do we? Uh, <laughs> I think, what's your, like, a ten and a half? Come on, I already <laughs> knew. I already knew I had to change my clothes. Bro, look at my freaking suitcase, dog. Weathered. It's fire. No. What? Keep it, looking. It, oh, this? No, keep looking. Oh, shit, there's no wheel. <laughs> Bro, it freaking cooked me. That's insane. This just it's happened. Clean oh, off. Yeah. Bro, cooked me. I pulled it off the, the conveyor belt. Gone. Bro's got the sparks coming out of the suitcase. <laughs> no, literally. Freaking, I'm so blown. Boys got the private terrace. Not a bad view. Big New York City <laughs> living. This is fire. Bro, it's summertime? Bro, we grilled out here so much this summer. That's like, what I'm saying. It's crazy. It's amazing. A little day bed. Yeah. They got like the Brooklyn Bridge. You can see like right there. Like Dumbo House is like right there. Oh, bro. It's so lit. This is perfect. Do you guys ever see like your neighbors? Like any of these guys? Not really. Not really. We're out here more than most people. That makes sense. But it sucks because now it's like getting cold. It's like kind of like kind of come up here and just like yeah but dude the summer was such a vibe like the, the, it was funny when i saw the apartment it was all foggy so i didn't oh, even see what the view was, the view was yeah. and then i came over here and i was like <laughs> i was like bro whole downtown view this little is, trade bro, this is so sick like legit i love this spot yeah no it's good yeah. it's definitely a good it makes a lot of sense for you guys too yeah we just signed two years two years yeah it's real cheap it hasn't been a year yet though has it's it? been one year dang september he said it's real cheap. <laughs> <laughs> Considering it's not too bad. No, I mean, at least you guys get to split it. Yeah, no, well, yeah. If you were here by yourself, oh, no. that would be <laughs> insane. <laughs> I've just had a lot more money than everybody has. <laughs> Bro, you have to. Had, to. had to change my outfit because I'm about to go do some work, which is why I'm here. So, this is the fit for today. And I started showing you guys my fits. I got this hat from Distress Fest. 
don't know if I showed you guys that, but I, I'm gonna do a full pickups video for like everything that I've gotten in the last. But this flannel is also from Distress Fest. Got Buck Mason T-shirt on, Abercr vintage Abercrombie on the pantalones, and then I'm gonna wear my Vans right here and my David and Goliath or and my pasture sample jacket. Fire. Come on, baby. A reversible, baby. Yes, sir. And then we kind of lucked out with this spot. Bro, the spot is so fire. And honestly, like, of all the walk ups you've had, this is the best. It's like, yeah, it's not too bad. Yeah, this is the best walk up for sure. Can you, um, I don't think I know his number. Oh, I'll give it to you. And just got this. It's just a case. All right. Heading to set. Running behind as per usual, but not a bad thing. For Justin? Yeah. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Alright. Just made it, just made it. Hello. Yeah. Good to see you too. Oh, you got a little pump. Oh, so sweet. It's small. How are you feeling? Good. I feel great. Yeah. It's been, uh, I almost felt a little funny. Yeah. <laughs> Hi. 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 You know what I mean? How are you? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Nice to meet you. Hello. Nice to meet you. Are you from Maryland? I am. I saw your area code. Oh, yeah. yeah. I love that. Yeah, where are you from? DMV. Where are you from? Uh, Fort Washington. Okay. Yeah. I grew up in Silver Spring. Oh, sick. Yeah. What high school did you go to? Uh, I then moved over to Rockville for high okay. school. I went okay. to WJ. Okay, cool. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Awesome. All right. Yes, Thanks. Oh, is that your normal, this your is normal my, little setup? This is my little vlog camera here. Yeah. You're going to do a little vlog too? I mean, maybe if you guys let me. Yeah, of course. Oh, sick. Why not? Yeah, I'll vlog. Yeah. Well, this is a great spot. I've been I've been chilling here for like a little bit now. Okay. I've been hanging out. Go ahead. I love this place. You've <laughs> been occupying a hiding in the corner. Yeah, we're at Brooklyn Blend. I chose this spot because one, black owned. Two, uh, I have a very like nutritious diet. I try to be very specific with the things I eat and everything that they have here on the menu is absolutely amazing. All right, just finished up at Brooklyn Blend. We're heading to the next spot now. These boots are legit, very, very comfortable. This is not me like trying to sell you guys on these, but these are actually super comfortable, very fire. I will be wearing these for sure, especially when it, once it gets like colder and stuff, like when I take my trips to go snowboarding and everything. And I love a duck boot. You guys have seen me wear duck boots before on the gram, so it's not too far off. Um, but yeah, quick, quick, easy morning so far. Um, I've worked with Hypebeast before, so I know everybody on the team for the most part. Uh, funny enough though, I was styling before, so now I'm doing more, um, like I'm the talent this time, which is pretty cool. I like being on both sides, like, depending on the projects and stuff. So, yeah, it's been really cool. Uh, we're heading to the next spot, which is called Colbo. Um, I put it on my list, but I've actually never been, but I have such high hopes in the spot that like, I don't have to go in order for me to know that like, I'm gonna have stuff to talk about there and things to love and all that. So um, yeah, I'm excited to try it out for the first time, check it out. Um, but yeah, hopefully you guys got some good clips. Taya, my manager, she did all the filming. 
She's the one who I said hi to when I first got here this morning. She's pregnant, expecting a baby. So her and Tosh are kind of on the same timeline, which she's really excited about. Um, but yeah, again, if you guys are ever in Brooklyn, New York, check out Brooklyn Blend. Even if you're just in New York, it's worth it. It's worth the trip. Trust and believe. Very, very good. I got the same thing that I always get: falafel wrap and a smoothie. I had a ginger shot also, two ginger shots, and a matcha. So I'm feeling great right now. Can't lie. And then, um, then yeah, we'll see how the rest of the day goes. I, I styled a lot of stuff. Oh yeah, with you guys. Yeah, I styled like maybe. I mean, I did like a stint. I probably did like five or six projects yeah. back to back. Yeah. And then, and then it just tanked. Was that when Natalia was here? Yes, Natalia was here. Um, yeah, Joe. We're still here, obviously. Um, hey, Joe. But I think uh, prior, most of it, I moved. I ended up moving to LA, so I think that yeah. shut a lot of it down. Yeah. And then. We're um, out in LA. That's what he says, but I think Joe was like, he works with the styles out there already. And he I was does. like, bro, no worries. Like, I'm it's not trying to. New York was I'm sure yeah. not. I, yeah. One of my best friends is out in LA. Okay, so there you go. Yeah. But. On the tap talent scene. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
set of attack as you've already shoes over. I need to get right here. Um, can we move that jacket back? Or? Guys, I can get you guys a clear. Yeah. Oh, Store is good. One second, I'm just getting my. Okay, I'm gonna use Justin Boone's body to block you. The new DP. When did you start vlogging? When did I start? I started vlogging. I don't even know. I mean, my first one, I don't know if that counts, but I've been vlogging more consistently now just for a couple weeks. Then, like, uh, this would probably be like my seventh one. I only have four up though right now, so I have like a backlog of a couple that I need to edit. Put it on like YouTube? Yeah, they're all on YouTube. Oh, cool. Yeah, yeah. So, but people are asking for more than just vlogs now too. So I gotta, gotta up my game. Yeah. They want to see like style videos and stuff like that. So, I promise it's coming. I promise it's coming. When I get more time. Or when I make more time. Oh, in the doorway? Just to find a way to like get your Modern day blog. A modern day. <laughs> it blog. is a modern day TikTok blog. The shoot with it. You're good. It's called vlog. rap but one day I'll be able to learn to rap but oh, hey, hey. hey it'll taste <laughs> 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 
Look at all these people okay. taking videos can I take a stand of our star. My sorrel boots. <laughs> Is the bags in the way? Uh, yeah, let's actually move them. Eva, you go. Um, and then when we do the where I'm at, is go for it. Oh, guys, we just stopped into Kobo, cop a new hat to match the boots. You know, the other one was good, but this one feels like it's a little bit more complete with the fit. Also got another matcha. So, if you guys in the city, you gotta check out Kobo. Fire. Did you guys can see, I got a new hat. Shout out to High Beast. Shout out Sarah. Um, it's been a day so far. It's been really cool. Been chilling. Wow, the lighting right now looks amazing. Um, we're headed to Cafe Jaton. It's our last location. Um, great location. But yeah, I really love being in New York. It's really fun. The shoot day has been so easy. Working with the best people. It's been fun. These are the days where like it doesn't feel like you're working. And that's how I like to work. As they say, if, if it feels like work, then you're doing the wrong thing. So, this feels good. I'm really happy. How you if feel? If you do what you love, you never work a day in your life. There we go. See? She gets it. And this is the couscous as is. What? You know, I should have listened to you. Chill. You gonna eat all that? Oh thing. my god. <laughs> tell all your plans. Damn. Yeah, you. Yeah, you. You slide. Yeah. Hold on, yeah, I'm, you I'm can't feeling. eat all that, man. You gotta give me a little taste of that. Hey, yo. We got other got things. One towels over there. <laughs> you said the two I'm, towels. I'm gonna knock them down. <laughs> Hey, what? yo, that's two nah, in a row. that was wild. That's that two was in wild. a row. I didn't even catch that. First one was, let me get a taste of that. And the Come second here. one was, I'm gonna knock the chicken sandwich? Oh, I think that's it. Um, oh, I mean, sorry. You know, that was my bad. Here you go. Oh, thank you. Avocado. Uh, I'm like, look at that. We have one more chicken sandwich. I did what you wanted. Chicken sandwich? Chicken sandwich? Come on, man. She was like, don't do that to me. Got to pay attention, bro. I'm paying attention. What's that yellow stuff? I don't know. What is that? Dressing. I had meatballs. Yeah, I just thought the meat. Yeah, in the middle. Thank you. Oh, wow. Yeah. Gorgeous. The sanitary team. Thank you. Yeah. Big feta. Thank you so much. Don't tell me what to do. The stuff is the dressing. Oh, my. You're so confused. Like, wait, what? Yeah. Um, we're going to steal your chicken. Cause, or your couscous oh my for a photo because right. it's your favorite dish. Do you need me to should nope. I get some video? This is for hype map. Okay. okay. That looks pretty good. Nice. straight up stole my meal. God damn. Is that rude? <laughs> no. <laughs> I, really, I really love couscous. I really do. That one tomato. Oh, couscous is good. Like, think about it. When's the last time you had couscous? Like, couscous is so it's good. It's not something you get off. It's not. It's not. So whenever I get I really should have. That's why every time I come here, oh, I get it. Oh, who got the tajik? Thank you. Yeah, that looks pretty good too. Yo, shout out to the beast, man. Another appetizer, do you want me to put it? Yeah, give us a little more. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Should we get that dish in it? What dish? I know, and I think this is enough. Do you want that? Those are his meatballs. Oh, well, that's mine, so we're going to swap that. So you can bring it over here. Do you want like the tajim dish, though? With that big Thank you so much. That's the spicy meatballs, that's you. But should we do that? I can get both tables, honestly. I can get this one. Or do you want to switch let's it with this? Sw let's swap the same. Wow. Right. I think that's a little Sorry, Janine. Just go live and I can share it. I know. <laughs> that's what I feel. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's how much like, off this table. Looks a little <laughs> more impressive. <laughs> yeah, no. All right. That is a wrap on the, today's shoot day. We are done, done, done. I'm going to go link up with Noah real quick. Um, what you guys saw earlier, that's Jackson's roommate. 
gonna go link him at this store that he's at that I've never been to. So see how that is. And then, yeah, I don't really have any plans for the rest of the evening. I got a couple of things later today, um, tomorrow, and then I'm out of here Thursday. So it is what it is. But just got to Stofa, nose in the back, looking at some stuff. But man, this brand is so sick. I never even knew this brand. The store was here. I eat next door at the Botanist all the time, but they've got some really, really sick stuff. Like, I'll just get the rundown off camera, but everything is just so well made. Brand is Italian. Look at the cotton on this, bro. Like, this is absolutely incredible. We've got some weddings coming up and stuff, so I'm definitely adding them to my brand list in regards to what it is that I want to wear. The footwear is all you guys is too? Yeah. Wow. Oh. So actually I kind of misspoke earlier. So the brand is actually based here in New York. Okay. But everything is just it's made, made in Italy. Italy. Exactly. Okay, gotcha. Okay, cool. Yeah, small family factors, that's the way to go. Yeah, man. That's why there isn't a price difference between ready to wear and made to measure. So, Fire, okay. For example, like we came in and wanted to get this jacket, but you needed a 54 and we didn't have any 54s made. Yeah. We just had the fabric. We would just hit them, get your measurements, and they would whip it up, man. There wouldn't be enough charge. You would just have to wait. You just have to wait for it to be made. Yeah. All right, that's perfect. Yeah, that's nice. This leather is crazy. Is this, what is this, lamb? Uh, yeah, that's our launch. This is insane, bro. It's some really detailed. And the oh my god. All our leather is barrel dyed, so okay. you don't have to worry about it scratching or anything like that. It's dyed all the way through. Got you. Even this under piece is insane. This is a wool, huh? Yeah, that's a wool vest. Oh, it's a vest. Same one. Dang. Is this one here? Okay. Got gotcha. you. So it's reversible as well. So that one's gonna be reversible. Okay. This one, the variation isn't as stark. Yeah. It's like you know, you have oh, chocolate, yeah, and you yeah, have to just wash that just, out a little okay. bit on the okay. back side, but. Yeah. Bro, sick. I almost wish it was a full jacket. So, the first one you do that is a full jacket is this guy here. Okay. So on the outside we have our brushed cashmere. Yeah. And then on the inside we have our cotton pop one, so you can just... Yeah, this is really turn it inside out. This is true luxury. So you can real and so uh, one of the things, we don't use any synthetic fabrics. Perfect. So everything is all natural. And so with like the cotton, for example, the cotton poplin, we just did a really, really tight weave so it becomes water repellent. Nice. Yeah, I could feel it when I, I felt it. I figured it was some type of water resistant. Mm -hmm. Nice. Keep looking at that. Can I try that other job? Yeah, sure. Just because I keep looking at it. So sick. That's gonna be big, but it's cool. Fifty's better. Yeah, I'm more like a 48, 46 even, but 50 should work out. This jacket made to measure. Do you want to go suede or do you want to go wool? Oh, so you guys can make it in any material that you guys have. Everything. You can do any shirt, you know, all the shirt material, you can do any jacket or outerwear. And you know, all the outerwear materials, fire. Okay, dang. That would be dope. Do something completely custom. Cause that's kind of what I was kind of going for. Like, I wanted to maybe do something custom. Dang, I gotta figure out what the weather's gonna be out there too though. That's, that's a, yeah, it's gonna be hot. <laughs> it's gonna be hot for sure. It's not gonna be jacket weather, but you know I do love to put a jacket on. This fabric that we have, it's a three ply fresco. Okay. It's super lightweight. I'm gonna grab it to show you. But okay. I think this is the type of jacket that you could wear if you were in Italy. Gotcha. Okay. Oh yeah, but I love a three-quarter button. Fuck with this. Yeah, the color is dope too. Mm. Fucking pattern too. Sick. Yeah. That's dope. 
so. This one, this is what happens when I stop over. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have any other pieces already? No, I don't have any stuff but actually. Oh, nice. I'm trying to find my first today. Sick. Wait, Justin, you might like this one, bro. Yeah, it's good I just tried the leathers right now. Oh, the type two, what? Yeah, exactly. Wait, can I try that on though? Or iteration of that. But what's it made out of? Cotton basket weave. Like in the name of basket weave? Yeah. Uh, construction. Sure. It feels like a like an elevated alternative to denim sometimes. Right. It's almost like a mole skin. It still has like a really beautiful skin feel, but this looks sick on you. But it's rugged. Yeah, that's kind of. And that's right. Yeah, exactly. It has like a, a little bit of that like sensibility. Yeah. So, what size is this one? Fifty. Mm. Yeah. It's cut, it's cut like Jenny. Yeah. It's, uh, it's like that. It's like it is. So, yeah. if you had to go to Italy in yeah. the summer, like Como, you had to wear a suit. This is. This is. Like this is the one, yeah. yeah. This is a dead stop tropical wool gauze material. Yeah, it's suited for warm weather for sure because it's such a bummy, but it's a natural slump that runs through the hot summer. You guys only do it in black? Yeah, it's only about in black. Okay. Yeah. Well, are these buttons custom? These are uh, Corozo nut buttons. So okay. They are they are custom to us. These are sick. Yeah, they're organically shaped. Yeah. yeah. So, I was thinking the taupe. It's um, almost like, like, little, like oh, yeah. This one. Right. I only have enough fabric for two more suits. This is um this is special. This is a core fabric that we have. Uh, here over here we we this is an undyed version of the wool. Um, it's a two clean, two ply wool, um, tropical wool weight. Still like Como appropriate. Oh, for sure. Yeah. So. Yeah. Single button. So you keep pulling out all the heaves. Yeah. This is our fabric. Yeah. Is this like brush cotton? Yeah. What is this? It's, 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 it's brush cotton, huh? When we sell out of it, it's like brush, it's like a yeah. cotton tool that we brush with. Yeah. yeah. And then it gets like very nappy. Because yeah. Then we just cut the nap as close as we can to the fabric. Okay. And then it gets like this very, like, uh, it's almost like a peach skin. This it looks incredible. That was good on me, bro. Thank you. It's the one button, bro. That's what I need. Yeah. It gives you that, like, really you need a smaller size, though. Yeah, so you need a smaller size, size for sure, push. but it's nice. Super deep on it. Yeah, those are both nice. Like, a lot. So you're saying this one, since this is a fabric that we develop on the ready to wear side, once we sell out, we're sold out. Right. Okay. It's something that's always available. Right. right to measure. That makes sense. And then we have more colors, um, obviously. So okay. Well, we got you covered. Yeah. No, I'm gonna definitely keep you online for sure because I really am liking what I'm seeing. Oh, really? Oh, I see. Okay. I was wondering why the seams were, they look different on both sides, but it's because the wave starts down and goes up. I was like, why is this so weird? That's dope. It would have been dope to see the seam keep going. That would have been really difficult. Oh, if they kept continuing the wave down there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'd be nuts. I'd be nuts. Yeah, I saw that. I saw, um, I don't know if it was that same color, but I saw that one up there too. Yeah, no, it's the same. Yeah, that's his idea. Exactly. That's a good jacket, bro. Yeah, it's reversible too. Yeah, it's So, what we did is cashmere. We attach dead thistle leaves to a rod and then tumble the cashmere over the thistle leaves in the rod and then it gets like this like almost like silken hair like super lustrous to it. We'll walk out with a piece. You know how it is. <laughs> Same inside job. Underwear on is crazy. I can't see her underwear bro. I mean, I can't. I, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
I made it a boxer with no pants on. That's crazy. Blazer. A blazer with no pants is nuts. This thing is Oh like, my god. I haven't even ever tried the pants on with this shit. You have pants with it? Yeah, bro. Yeah, we're not gonna lie, JR gave me this shit from, from uh, Dior. Yeah, we, were, we were talking about JT, I was like, bro, honestly, I really don't know a nigga like that, but he gave me the Tom Brown suit for half off, so. Holy shit, these are sweet. Yeah, you fat fuck. Wait, how many chrome pants do you have? Why well, I only see two? I have four. Alright, where are the other ones at? <laughs> bro, said, pull her out of chrome pants. Bro, but I just can't wear pants like that. You actually just look like weird. Look, about to go chrome on them. About to go. We about to go chrome on them. About to go. I mean, this is very classic though. I try these right now. I'm never. I'm never. That's the ones I want. Look at these. But like, you see what's in this? Oh, this is weird. I wouldn't wear that. I wouldn't wear the pants. Bro, sell like me these, bro. No, you don't, bro. You don't want those. I promise you, you don't want those. Why? No. I mean, this is exactly the pair. No I want. reinforcements on the um carpenter. You don't want those. I, I mean, like on here, right here? Yeah, you don't want those. Bro, but if they don't sell them with the reinforcements, bro, I, I have custom ordered pairs with that. You don't want them. There's gonna be this. So, you just look strange, bro. I wouldn't wear the pants, I would, but I can't wear the shoes. It looks fine. You look fine, bro, whatever. If you wear the product, like, I don't know. This is actually Dior. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> this, is actually, this is actually Dior. This is actually Eddie Dior. Actually. It looks too small. It, the jacket's the jacket's fine. The pants look weird. Bro. I yeah, you I can mean close it. I can close it. It's pulling. It's it's pulling it's a little. But that's how you were Eddie. That's how you were Eddie. It's pulling a little bit. We're this talking chrome right now. We're also talking Eddie Dior, which is like anorexic as hell. Oh, these are good. Bro. Yeah, Justin Miller. Ooh, that boy said go leather on him. We're going like, leather on him. Golly. That boy said we're going <laughs> leather on him. Oh, that, that, that hit a thud. Damn. Honestly, <laughs> like these are cool, but. No, they're not like that. Yeah. No, they're. Bro, I can't wear I can't. How about, honestly, bro, they're dog shit. I wear them because I wear them like when I'm destroying them. When I'm picking nice like, 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 I'm like, I'm wearing nice clothes. No one said you're not wearing nice clothes, bro. I'm just like saying. I'd rather do this one. <laughs> It fits me better. It fits me better. It's a little more like not as crazy. Like this is fine too. This is fine. Just a black shirt. You actually look great, bro. You actually look great, bro. I want to do snake look. <laughs> now I'll bring the black ones. A little big. What's wrong with you? Why are you? Why are you it's stressing this? It's I want to look great, no matter what. I don't care if you look great. I want you to look normal. I don't want to look normal. Why are you asking me to look normal? Why would you ask that of me? Because it's a fucking psychiatry conference. You're not supposed to look crazy. I'm not looking it's crazy. It's not a fashion, fashion convention. It's not a fashion convention. Well, it is for me. It's always a fashion convention, right, Jackson? Yeah. You gotta represent, baby. And to be honest, these pants that I'm wearing currently are like a little loose on me, so they kind of look pretty normal. The next day, my last full day in freaking, my last full day in New York, got on slightly different fit, kind of the same fit, I don't know. I didn't bring many clothes here with me, so the weather is much, much different than how it was when I was here in September. It's definitely getting cold. If I was living here still, it would for sure be time to throw the gloves on and such because I mean not quite gloves yet but it's getting there it's definitely jacket coat thermal like that type of type of weather which I don't have a thermal with me and this is the only jacket I have but it is what it is. I'm on my way to get breakfast right now with Jeremiah and Wisdom K. Going to Dimes Deli. My favorite spot, of course. That's where I ate last time, where I had the 
that kind of breakfast bowl and a smoothie and stuff. It's from that same spot. And then, this is where we ate last night. Me, Jackson, and Noah ate there last night, which is called Kiki's. A really good spot. That's one of Telstra's like favorite spots. So, it's very familiar with the menu. It's also Greek food. Greek food is always typically safe for me because I don't eat dairy. Yeah, I had a branzino, a whole branzino last night. That was fun. I had some calamari. That was also good. Um, I think I said this yesterday, but I want to go back to Kobo today. And I'm still trying to determine what I should get Telstra for anniversary. But I'm thinking about getting her. I think I want to buy it for her and just get it as like a just because gift, but not give it to her anytime soon, just like randomly. You know, just like randomly cop it for her, but we'll see, I don't know. But pulling up to Dimes now. That boy Jeremiah just walked in the door. I don't know if y'all saw that. Back like we never left. Come on, I know you man. guys are always saying, "Hey, you guys are inseparable." Well, it's true. <laughs> well, it's true. It is true. Okay. You take a little flick. No, nah, it's one of my vlog. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're <laughs> up like it. Hey guys, it how you doing? I'm Wisdom. Yo, I'm Jeremiah. Guys, what's on? Jump. <laughs> We're out here. All right, Russell, run me through your fit. Um, no, 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 I don't want to. Old Navy. I don't need you to do that. Old Navy. No, 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 I don't need you to do that. That's crazy. Jill Sander, Tom Wood. <laughs> Tom Wood. <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe. All right, boy. Well, Hit right, me later. Brother. You going to hit me to Versailles? Yeah, I'm going to call him and see where he's at. We just had breakfast. Talk to him, bro. We no, 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 go ahead. Be out. We gotta figure out a different. No, because we always soup at the same. Like we soup I'll, at the same level. You go up top. Hey. <laughs> yeah. See. You hey. got that. <laughs> <laughs> you go. You go up top, baby. You know what I mean. <laughs> All right, man. I love you, boy. Oh. Of course, bro. Yeah, call me. All right. You gonna walk it out? Hour twenty. Yeah, that's a deep one. Where are you in? No, you're not in Brooklyn. I'm in Michigan. Okay. Yeah, it's so far from everything. That's the one downside. Yeah, Midtown, Midtown is kind of far, that's true. I mean, I got my AirPod, I got battery. I think I can walk it. Yeah, you can walk it. At least for a bit. I'm gonna try and get me a Masha from somewhere. Man, I don't have too much to do today. That's a plus. Yeah. Wait, what time is it? Um, uh, 11.25. Oh, perfect. Um, my, have you ever been to this store called Le Garçon? No. My, I thought somebody said my name. Well, my good God, to see you, good bro. to see you too, bro. Let's hang out. Okay, sure. let's do it. All right, bro. Enjoy the day. Yeah, you too. All right, later. Just had breakfast. It was fire. Very good times. Very good intentional times. Um, I think I'm gonna go pull up on Noah and catch his store. It's kind of far though. Let me see. Oh, it's not that bad if I hop on a city bike. I think I'm gonna get a city bike. You know, I love me a city bike. Grab me a bike. Make that move real quick. Let me see how I can do this, man. <laughs> get away from me. Nah, I'm just kidding. We're inseparable. Very hip to hip. Bro, for real, hip In to hip. Inseparable. Hip to hip. Yeah, uh, the crib. Pick up my parents. They want to come. Oh, fire. Off at. Where's your phone Off of uh, off of 34th. 35th, actually. I gotta get off at of 34th. I gotta go to Safiana. Let me take my headphones off now that you're next to me. You know, I'm a real New Yorker. Mm -hmm. I'm just like, uh, I got no headphones with me. Tragic. That was crazy. I thought you did. Oh, no, that was I only crazy. got the over the ear joints. I'm getting 34th. I got two more stops after that. Take it off at Rockefeller. 
all that ass. Should we just start harmonizing here like those dudes in the subways? Alright. <laughs> My last day in New York has been pretty fulfilling. Um, I didn't take you guys with me this afternoon too much. Um, Cause I was at Saks, talking with Kamari, catching up, good friend of mine, and then also went to Cartier, see my friend Brandon, look at some potentials for Telsha for the future. Um, and yeah, you just can't really record in those stores and stuff like that. And I didn't even want to try, um, but I just got back downtown. I have a meeting in a few minutes, so after my meeting, um, we'll pick back up with the consistent vlogging. I've got a couple events to go to tonight. Uh, I'm gonna get dinner with the boys because Silas is, is in town. Devin is also in town. And then, yeah, Jeremiah has moved here. So he has a lot, a lot to look forward to. I got an event at Burberry, celebrating with my brother Aaron. So yeah, there's a lot going on this evening. Um, I might switch over to my phone though so that I'm not vlogging with my camera just because I don't want to have to bring it with me everywhere, but we'll see. I will say I'm getting more comfortable walking around holding my camera because um, that is what it is. Like, what you gonna do? Say something about me? Make a joke? I'm fly, so can't say I'm a loser. <laughs> but anyway, um, heading over to my meeting, so I'll catch up with you guys in a few minutes when I'm done with that.